Getting to the corner office takes longer today than 20 years ago. That is according to a report by Hydric and Struggles, a U.S. leadership consulting company. They surveyed more than 1,000 firms across the globe and picked out the skills that CEOs need today in order to be a good leader. Let's find out what those skills are. A little earlier, I spoke to Alain Deneau, the and he began, and I began by asking if the best bosses are hired internally or externally. This point might be quite interesting to analyze. I mean, mm -hmm. some 15 years ago, probably half of the CEO would have been hired outside, and today it's only 25%. Mm -hmm. And what about the multinational companies compared to the medium and small enterprises? Should the skill sets be the same? They're not. I mean, most of them would be the same, of course, for CEOs. But you can analyze. I mean, if you look for big multinational, most probably these guys would be more global and would have the capacity to manage a complex internal network, whereas, I mean, in a small size company, would be looking for extremely entrepreneurial profile. Alan, you've been a CEO for many, many years. You've been here in Asia since the 1980s. How did you improve your skills from then and until today to remain where you are? Ah, that's <laughs> okay. So you have to adapt to culture. Mm -hmm. I think multi multi multicultural, sorry. I mean, uh, to adapt to different culture is quite important, that's of course. Uh, languages also is quite important to understand the external world in which you work. Is a master's degree uh, <coughs> in, in business uh, now important uh, to become a CEO? It's much more important today. I mean, today you need to have the same strong leadership mm. skills as before, but on top of that, you need to have strong degrees. But what about Mark Zuckerberg, uh, Bill Gates? Uh, uh, you also have the likes of Jack Dorsey, Steve Jobs. Some of them never even finished university, don't even have MBAs. That was more than 15 years ago. To <laughs> today, you need the same skills that these guys plus higher education. But now in the 2020s, uh, CEOs are facing uh, many more problems, particularly like the coronavirus. What kind of skill set do you need as a CEO to be able to deal with these kinds of emergency situations? No, you're right. I mean, the world today is full of black swan, I mean, mm -hmm. much more than yesterday. So CEOs would need to have the capacity to react, analyze quickly without I mean, compromising long-term. So they have to be both short-term reactive and long-term.